What's going on guys? Bob Buskirk here at Think Computers and today we're going to show you the UEFI BIOS here on the ASRock Fatality Z97 Killer Motherboard. Now this um, BIOS should be pretty much the same throughout their Z97 series, maybe a different skin or something like that, but the options should be pretty much the same. So when you go into the BIOS, this is going to be the first screen that you see. This is the main screen. And on here, you're going to get, you know, your version of your BIOS, your processor, your speed, all of that stuff, um, your memory, what you have installed. There's a My Favorites folder, which you can set up yourself. Um, you can go in there and you can add things to your favorites. So if you have certain settings that you want, you can go ahead and add um, them in here. Of course, being a UEFI BIOS, you can use the mouse and keyboard if you like. Um, you can also set the page here on entry. So when you go into the BIOS, you can set what page you want. So if you want your favorites to load, if you want the OC tweaker page to load, you can have all that stuff load um, when you go right into the BIOS besides the main screen. Um, you can set if you want the full HD UEFI. And they actually have a guide here that's built into the BIOS that will kind of just show you how to use it um, if you're not familiar with it, which is actually pretty cool. Now, if we go over here to the OC tweaker, if you're going to be overclocking or changing the speed of anything or voltages or any of that stuff, you're going to find it in this menu here. And what's great is that they give you the target CPU um, speed and your target memory speed. So if you're changing things around, you're going to go ahead and be able to see what your target speeds are. You know, you have all of your normal settings here for changing the CPU speed and all of that. And as we go down here, we have our DRAM timings as well. Um, and it actually lists the XMP profiles right here. So you can actually see what they are. Um, which is actually pretty cool. And all of that can be set up right in here. Um, all of your voltages and all of that stuff can be set up. If you go into advanced, that is all of your settings for everything. So your chipset, CPU, storage, all that stuff that's on here can be set up. And of course, if you go into these, you have all of the different settings for what you're going into. This is typical on any motherboard. Um, not much different really. Um, it's just set up in these little folders and it shows you, you know, the options that you do have for the certain parts of your motherboard. If we go into tool here, um, there's actually some pretty cool stuff in here. Let me move it back up to the top. Um, system browser um, will show you different parts of the board, which is actually pretty cool. Um, you know, if you're not really sure what is what and what's enabled and all of that stuff, it kind of will show you like we have a, um, a solid state drive installed and you can see that it tells us the information on that drive, which is actually pretty cool. Um, you can see that we have two memory sticks installed and you know what they are and it lists the timings. And of course you can see our processor that's in there as well. Um, you know, it's actually pretty cool. So like I said, if you don't know a lot about your motherboard or what's installed or anything like that, you can go ahead and see that, you know, pretty cool actually. So we have that. Um, we have our online management card, which is actually quite cool if you're trying to get people to not use the internet or something like that. What you can do is you can restrict um, internet usage. So if you want no internet and no internet usage at a certain time of the day or something like that, you can actually set it up right here in the BIOS. So you can set it up, save it, and the internet will, or network activity, I would assume, would be completely turned off um, at that point in time. Um, you can actually send a text service request as well, right in the BIOS. Um, and then you have Easy Rate Installer, Easy Driver Installer, all of that stuff. You can update. You can instantly flash the BIOS and save the BIOS and um, flash it from the internet within the BIOS, which is actually pretty cool. You have all that different type of stuff. Um, and you can save and load profiles in here as well. It does have a built-in hardware monitor, so you can let me bring this up to the top again. You can go ahead and see your temperatures, your fan speeds, and your voltages um, in real time, which is good if you're overclocking or tweaking or something like that. You want to make sure your CPU is not overheating or something along those lines. And then you can set up your fan settings as well, as well as over temperature protection, which will shut the system down if the CPU or other temperatures get too hot. Of course, you would want that to happen. You don't want to burn out a brand new CPU. We have our boot over here. Um, which will give you your boot options and all of that. And you can set some things up like boot from onboard LAN and all of that stuff, your normal boot menu right in here. Um, and then for security, you can set up supervisor password and user password. Um, 
and you can set up secure boot as well right in here and then you can um, go over to exit and of course you can save changes and exit and all of that um, really nice bios i really do like it it's pretty much down to the point very easy to use it's not sluggish or anything like that again you can use both your mouse and keyboard on here um, the descriptions over here are in depth as well so if you don't know what a certain option is um, it gives you that option over here so you can see what things are um, and everything like that so i, I really do like it. it it works really well no real issues with it um, this makes using the BIOS extremely easy. So if you have any questions, go ahead and leave them in the comments below. And remember guys, if you like our videos, why don't you subscribe? Catch you guys later.